When I was a child, my father for a few years uh, was a cartoonist. He would always be drawing and creating characters and environments where these characters lived, and I, and I love that. Things were very simple, you know, circles and squares, and it, it was all reduced to the basic elements, like you would draw a house or a tree, and it was just like, a, almost like a kid would draw it. I grew up in Buenos Aires, in Argentina. I came here to go to graduate school and do a, a master's degree in architecture. I started doing kids' furniture almost from the beginning, because even when I was doing architecture, my sketches and, and some of the projects, they looked a bit kind of like for kids, you know? I like to make them kind of like naive looking. A lot of the principles are the same in architecture and, and furniture. You have to deal with the gravity and, and things have to have a structural integrity. And then there's this uh, relationship with the, with the body, the physical part. The fact that we interact, that we, we touch it. But then in furniture, there is something about you know, the immediate gratification that you can see it very quickly and, and know if it works or if it doesn't. A good design is usually when you cannot tell that it was designed, when it almost looks like it was just built. The, the carpenter that builds a sawhorse or a table to have lunch, he's not thinking what's gonna look pretty. He thinks, okay, what is gonna solve my problem? What is a surface where I can work and it's gonna be strong and I can make it quick? And you can find beauty in that. And if not beauty, at least you find intelligence and you find uh, knowledge. If you focus too much on the design in itself, or if you put too much attention in the shape, then you're probably not paying enough attention to other things. People say, oh, you're an artist. I'm not an artist, I am a designer, and it's different. Architecture, design, art, and music, all of that somehow informs your practice. But furniture is furniture, art is art, and architecture is architecture. There are relationships, there are connections, there are similarities, but you have to understand what is the essence of, of furniture. And it's something that translates into the designs in themselves. I like to keep them as simple as possible, as easy as possible. You know, it's a drawer, it's a drawer, a door is a door, and, and like kids understand that. Kids, they're not gonna fake anything. They like it or they don't like it. It works or it doesn't. And when you see that, you know, you're doing something for them that is, it helps them in their lives and in their daily activities. That's one of the most gratifying things.